Hey guys, this is Kathy. Welcome back to my channel, Kathy's Favorite Things. You guys, happy Friday. Um, we are with Augustine. Say hi, Augustine. Hi. Augustine and I are on our way to Poughkeepsie. We need to go get um, Ado's passport. It came back with the visa that he needs to travel to Spain. And we need to go get Ado's bike from the house we, he used to live in. So that's what we are doing today. Um, we are at McDonald's right now, waiting uh, to order a Happy Meal for Augustine so he can eat it on the way there. And I'm also gonna try to update you on some things that happened this week. So, Monday, I had my appointment with gastroenterology, which I um, had some new medicine prescribed, which I haven't been able to pick up from the pharmacy yet because I've had such a busy week. Um, so she ordered some tests and gave me some new medicine and I have a follow-up in a few months and all of that, it's all set up. So that's good, that was for me. Then Tuesday, Augustine had the appointment with the developmental pediatrician and uh, he got prescribed the medicine to for the ADHD which again we haven't been able to pick up because we have been so busy finishing up with the classes and all the homeschooling and all of that so I haven't been able to go to the pharmacy but he got that prescribed and he is going to be in a low dose and we have a follow-up in like two or three weeks now on Wednesday, <clears throat> we finished the homeschooling. We finished with everything. I just need to redo the report because I actually uh, emailed the person with the school district that is in charge of the homeschooling. And since we changed school districts, the report that I had done, um, she didn't want it with the papers from the homeschooling website. She wanted me to do it in like a form that she had. So I'm redoing that. I haven't been able to finish it yet. Um, hoping that I'm gonna do that this weekend. Um, because, you know, it's just been so many things happening. So I have to finish that, typing that all over again. I need to get some more ink for my computer because I run out of ink from printing so many things that I need to print. My husband has been in Montana all week. He's coming back today. Now, um, Thursday, Augustine had a dermatology appointment and he had seen this doctor before. He has prescribed things for his allergies and things with the skin, you know, he's allergic to a few things. So he has to use like specific body wash and stuff like that. <clears throat> and we saw him yesterday because Augustine has a condition on the skin, uh, which is caused because of uh, some immune deficiency, you know, um, it's called vitiligo. I hope you guys have heard about it. It's a discoloration on your skin and Augustine has it on his arms. And I've seen that for a few years and I had mentioned that to the dermatologist previously, um, like two years ago and Augustine which, you know, he was much smaller and it wasn't that visible when I told the, the dermatologist two years ago. So he didn't really listen to me and he said, oh, that's nothing, you know. I hate it when they do that because as a parent, we know what's going on with our kids. And this is not the first time that that happens to me when I bring Augustine to the doctor. Um, a lot of the things that we had done with him with like his health, I have noticed at an early age. And But I had to talk to the doctors a few times so they listened. And he finally yesterday paid attention and I said, listen, I need you to look at this. And if you cannot assess this, then refer me to somebody else because I really want someone to look at this and take it serious. So um, <clears throat> he called uh, the nurse and she went to grab the UV light and they looked at his arms and he said, oh yes, you are right, it is vitiligo. So 
now we get a referral we're gonna go see another dermatologist and um, he's gonna get UV treatment they need to do light treatment on his skin so when we know more I will tell you how that's going to be and how long and you know all that stuff he also prescribed some other lotions for him because his skin is always itchy and he's always scratching and you know so then after that yesterday I was supposed to go to several Dollar Trees that I you know they were in that area and we ran out of time we couldn't but we went to Saratoga we saw the duckies we went to a museum which I will share images of that in another video probably we went for ice cream and on the way back I went to wash my car and then after that I saw the screw in my tire so we had to go get that fixed and we waited there for a few you know maybe a half an hour 45 minutes and then we went home because we were exhausted and today we're on the go again so it's in a super super busy week like I said I hope to finish the report either tonight so I can mail it tomorrow and she can get it on Monday. I have until the 30th, but I don't want to wait till the last minute. So <clears throat> I need to do that today, tonight. Tomorrow is Patty and Kathy's open collab, you guys. So if you want to join us, the prompt is clay pots or terracotta pots. So you can, you know, join us and take a look at what we made with Patty. And that's it, you guys. Hope you're having a wonderful day and have a great weekend. Bye.